You came to my channel and thought you wasn't gonna subscribe? Where about, where is my phone? Where is my, I'm gonna call my lord. Hello guys, my name is Sam and I'm back with another video and today I'm gonna be reviewing the world's best full coverage foundation from the drugstore. So, oh, almost dropped her. Okay, this foundation came out maybe a month ago. This is the Maybelline Super Stay Full Coverage Foundation. I got the shade 360 uh, Mocha, and these are the claims. I'm, I'm, we're gonna do a wear test today, baby. We're doing a wear test, because if these claims don't live up to it, I'm calling my lawyer. So it says full coverage foundation up to 24 hours wear. This nigga ain't wearing it for 24 hours. Eight hours is enough for me. So we're gonna wear at least eight hours and we're gonna do some check-ins today, okay, honey? Okay. It says seamless matte finish. I told you the other day I got that oil slick. It better stay matte. Also, my pores could be able to breathe, but it ain't. It better stay matte, right? It ain't going nowhere, it ain't gonna budge, right? Cause right here it says, all free. And it also says, fade and transfer resistant. Y'all know I have problems with my shirts. I was getting foundation all over it. Okay, we finna test, we finna test dry. So we already got moisturized and everything today. We done got moisturized. Only thing I haven't moisturized yet is these lips right here. They finna get moisturized right quick cause they need to be done. Oh, look at them. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. And it says it's not supposed to sink into fine lines, and I have big problems with that with every foundation. So we're gonna really see if that's gonna work today. We're gonna put it to the test. The test, baby. So this is what the bottle looks like. The component, it has it squared up. Thank God. Thank God, honey, that it has it squared up because you know the other one, where I don't even have it with me, but it doesn't have a pump. You just have to pour it on there. So I'm just gonna do it. Maybe one, oh, if you can tell it's new, it's not coming out, baby. So I'm just do a few pumps. Okay, and it's supposed to be full coverage, like full, full coverage. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with the flow. So I'm just gonna take it, I'm gonna start on my neck. Just put it on my face. And I'm guessing this is gonna be enough that I put it on my hands if it's full, full coverage, you know? So we're gonna put it to the test today, baby. Because I've been looking for a good drugstore full coverage foundation for a while that doesn't sink into the small lines. And then it's good. So just wanna go ahead and we're gonna go to ham. We're gonna blend it into the skin. And this is the shade that I used in the other one. So I was hoping it was gonna match. It looks a little lighter on camera, doesn't it? Yeah. Mmm. We can make it work though. Cause this, it was like a darker shade that was way too dark for me. Mm. And I was not going for it, honey. Cause we ain't going super dark. We're either gonna go a little lighter and not too dark or what? Maybe my sponge is soaking up most of the, some of the product cause I did just clean my sponge. So far I'm not getting the feeling of it's full coverage at all. I'm gonna put some more on my face because it's not the coverage that I want on my neck, especially. Because y'all know I like to go for coverage on it. I mean, it covered up some of the darkness, though. So I'm happy about that. Most of the foundations that I do, where it doesn't cover up the darkness. It feels different. I've never, like, felt a foundation that feels like this, for real. I like it. As y'all can see, she, she's, like, basically the perfect color. So now I'm just going to go in with some um, concealers. I'm going to take the Wet n' Wild Photo Focus Concealer. I'm just gonna take a little bit of her today. I'm gonna take up here in the corners. You know I me, mean, we're always going like with three concealers anyway, so that's why I'm taking a little bit. So I'm gonna just take a little bit of LA Pro Girl Concealer. Just take a little bit of her on this, uh, this fine day. We're just gonna bring her under the eyes like so. What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be going in with some shape tape. You know, I like to go with my little tan, but I like to put a dot here, some dots on there to make it look a little lighter. So now we're just gonna go ahead and blend the concealer out. 
under the eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and powder those. Go ahead on these small lines, make sure they worked out. Press some powder into those. Dust some powder around the rest of my face, especially on this neck down here. Go ahead and set her the rest of my face. Just wanna set it with some powder. Make sure they locked in place. Ain't going nowhere. And I kinda wanna put a little extra powder on this nose. And I'm just gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows. So I'm gonna just leave this powder sitting for I can let it bake to control the oils. As, as we say, we're gonna control the oils. We're gonna bake at 350 degrees today. Okay, hunty. And now I'm just gonna go off camera and I'm gonna finish up the rest of my face and I'll be right back and we're gonna do a wear test throughout the day. Okay, I'm back and this is the finished look that I'm gonna be doing and I'm gonna come back and do we're gonna, I'm gonna be basically vlogging throughout the day and tell you how the product hold up. So I probably, after four hours, I can already know, I can tell if I like it or not, if it keeps the oil at bay, or if it's just like a slight bit of oil and a healthy glow, I will give it a thumbs up. But if it's a slip and slide baby. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna come back and do check-ins and I'll end the video later. Okay guys, so we're gonna be doing a wear test. As you can see, I have not powdered anything, but you can see my smile lines coming through. We have a little oil coming in right now, and it's like, uh, I'm not gonna clock the foundation out yet, but it's trying to clock out early on me. I'm gonna have to call my lawyer. So we're gonna do another check-in in about another hour right now. It is, what time is it? It's about 2.43, we'll be back about 3.43, okay? Are you back, guys? Look at that, bro. It's snatched. Okay, guys. I did like one or two chickens. I don't really remember how many I did, but I'm just going to add them in. And also, I'm just... <sighs> the oil is really bad. Like, I mean, it's not really bad. It's just like the usual. And I thought like, since this was a matte foundation, it's not, I'm not saying that I wouldn't wear it again. But, you know, it seeps into my smile lines. I had to fix them a little bit because I had to go out and do some grocery shopping. I didn't want to look rough. I didn't want people to be looking at me like, oh, and I'm like, it's okay, boo. I'm just doing a wear test. You know, you ain't going to run telling nobody that. And I also had to go see my, you know, boo thing or whatever. So I also had to fix up just a little bit because I did have really bad creases here. <sighs> when you do a wear test, you're not supposed to fix up, but you know, I had some stuff to do today. I like the foundation. I like the foundation, but I wish it would live up to the expectations that it had on it. That I, when it said it was full coverage, I had to go in with two layers. And it said seamless matte finish. Seamless makes me think like it don't seep into your smile lines, which as you can see, it did right here. And then I have up here and I thought it was gonna be like a smooth canvas. I mean, I mean, I don't mind it like this or whatever. It's, it's nothing I can't fix throughout the day, but I want you to live up to what it says on the back of this bottle. Um, I will be wearing this again to give it another test. Today was kind of really, kind of, it wasn't hot, but it wasn't cold kind of a day. It was like a little warm, so when it's like a little cooler and I'm not getting any glow or sweat or anything, I'm gonna try it out again. And yes, I really enjoyed this foundation. I love doing these kind of videos. If you want me to try out any kind of foundation and let you guys know about it, as long as they have it in the people of color shades, I will go get it for you and I will test it out. I will do a wear test. And you know, you thought you thought I forgot. You thought I forgot this. Uh, have you subscribed? If not, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Yes, guys, I will enjoy. I will love you forever. If you hit the subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up. And what all you guys have been waiting for, I will be doing a giveaway. This is the rules for the giveaway. I want you to be subscribed to my channel, like always, and make sure the bell notification is turned on for you know when I upload these videos. Like, every day I upload them like 7 or 8 o'clock at night. And they're ready to go for you guys. Lots of laughs, lots of fun, sometimes seriousness. But you know, we here and we better. Okay, the rules for the giveaway is make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure the bell is turned on. And also, when you share me on, share me on your social medias, but then 
The hard part about it is you gotta make one of them people on your social medias, just one, subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'm gonna need them to tell me down below who sent them to my channel. So the person that you sent need to comment your name down below. So, and they need to subscribe to my channel. And if they don't subscribe or put your name down below, you will not be entered into the giveaway. I'm so sorry, but this $100 giveaway is strict. My giveaways are gonna be stricter because I gotta make you work for the coin that I be spending, okay? If you ain't working for this coin that I'm spending, then what's the use if you winning anything, okay? If I gotta work, you gotta work. If I gotta work hard, you gotta work hard. So make sure they come in your name down below and so they, that you who you sent to my channel, subscribe to me, okay? Okay, 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 okay. And I have enjoyed filming this video for you guys. I'll see you guys next time with another video. And today, we are gone. Yeah.